Hello everybody and welcome back to Brood War, where we are pushing our way through roughly a million Terrans. And we just took this expansion here and need to get some probes mining. There we go. Go ahead and do that. We've got ourselves a couple of Archons here ready to go. We need to reinforce this little army here. Excellent. Okay, so we've got a Templar here and we have, what, two more Templars coming in. Okay, excellent. For a second there, I thought I miscounted, but I did not. So let's go ahead and combine that into an Archon. And then I think... Actually, I think a pair of DTs from each gateway should be good. And then we just spam out a few Zealots, most likely. We can go ahead and go for ground weapons level 2 as soon as we've got the gas for that. We've taken heavy gas down in this expansion, so that should be fine. We can go ahead and combine these guys into Archons. Fantastic. And now we have DTs on the way in. Ground weapons level 2. Starting now. Excellent. And now we just need to burn a bunch of minerals. So I think I'm just going to queue up a bunch of Zealots. There we go. Okay, so we've got our DTs here. We've got roughly a million Archons. And I just want to do a very slow advance here. I'd like to run our Observer up here and see... Oh, okay, we can park right here and just hold position. And I think we can use our Reaver. Although I kind of, before we strike out with this, I kind of want to have this force down here. Come on down, guys. You too, Dark Templar. Get on down here. Excellent. So many Archons. They can't find their way through. Okay. They'll get there eventually. We do have these Scarabs, of course. Or, not these Scarabs, these Reavers. They are you know, ready to go if necessary, but I'm happy just using a single reaver right now. Let's take out this bunker that's on the high ground. Oh, no, we can't do that. Uh, so we can't hit that even when we have vision. That's interesting. Well, let's fly our observer around over here then and see what we've got over here. Do they have any other bunkers on the high ground? No? Okay. Under attack up here. That shouldn't be an issue, I think. I think we can hold off these wraiths. Maybe. I want a cannon here. And I want another cannon here, just to be safe. There we go. Okay, so we've got these zealots. So I think at this point, what we have to do is we just have to try to push in here. So come on down here, Reaver. I want to kind of shy over to this side. There we go. Defend that Reaver. Excellent. I want you to take out this. There we go. So far, so good. Okay, push your way in, guys. We need to get up to this bunker up top. They've got a tank up there. But we've got DTs. The DTs are currently revealed, but we're fine. We got this. This push is successful. Okay. Come on down here, Scarab. And we're just going to continue pushing through here. I don't know why I keep calling him Scarab. He's a Reaver. <laughs> That's a little weird. Hello. Okay. So, we're on the high ground right now with this force. Let's go ahead and... Hello. That's a ghost. Get out of here, ghost. Okay, let's go ahead and pull our Reaver up here. Just to be on the safe side. I'm going to use this little force here to scout down and see what's through here, if anything. 
Looks like nothing. Okay. You guys can join our main force, then. You guys can as well, now that I think about it. Let's get ourselves a couple more Templars. Oh my. They scanned us? That's irrelevant. Really don't care about that. We should consider getting that Observer down here, though, in case they get cloaking. Hello! Here's a production base. And a relatively undefended one, in fact. You guys can go take care of that vulture, that's not an issue. I'm not gonna waste any scarabs on this. No point. You guys get up here. Okay. You guys defend the Reaver. You guys keep pushing. I wanna see what's up here. Anything here? No? Okay. Well, there's a fire bat that we could kill. <laughs> Excellent. Guys, don't get pulled into their base. Okay. I just want to skirt around the edge of their base here and see what we can find. There's a million missiles over here, but take out these tanks. Or this tank, I guess. Okay, there's a missile turret there. Let's go ahead and bring this group down this way. Oh, we've got a fire bat. Kill that fire bat. Now come on down here. I don't want you guys to get pulled into that bunker. Kill this missile turret. Nice. Very nice. That's a lot of damage to them right there. Okay, Reaver's on his way in. We're going to use the Reaver to take out this bunker, and then we're going to just push on in. You guys, in the meantime, can go ahead and push up this way, looks like. Oh, there is a bunker up there. That's okay. We're going to be able to take all of this out easily enough. So go ahead and take out this bunker. There you go. Oh, we're hitting the missile turret, too. That's nice. We can hit their economy from this direction. Go. Okay, here we go. I want you guys to come in as well. We're just hitting from the back here. We're going to do so much damage. This is absurd. Observer, you can remain a little safer. You can stay down here. Yeah, they, they have no way of defending this, looks like. Okay, so we do see a deployed siege tank down here that I would very much like to kill. Oh, we've got zealots on it. Nice. We see a bunker here. Reaver, get up here. Very, very nice. We've done so much damage. This is over. They can't win. So we need to bring Kerrigan to the crystal, correct? So let's have you guys merge to Archons. In the meantime, you guys can continue pressing through the Terran base over here. No problems here. Excellent. There we go. Come on through here. Ooh, here's our stargates. Our star ports. I keep messing that up. <laughs> okay. You guys push on up this way, and their base is pretty much dead. So all we need to do then is get Kerrigan to the correct location. Reaver, you can come on down here and take out this turret. You guys can hit up this way. Uh, looks like they might have another base up here, actually. I, I suppose I wouldn't be surprised to find that. And yeah, it looks like they do. So come on up here, guys. That's fine. We'll push through that. This Dark Templar can come up here and kill that. That'll be fine. In the meantime, we'll have Kerrigan and the two Archons come down here. There we go. So we've taken out their main base at this point. They have a little bit left, but not much. Okay, let's go ahead and hit it. They are not going to be able to defend this, I don't think. They do have a tank. We'll take out that tank. Yeah, that's not a problem. Push on in, guys. 
And then we've got our Archons here. The Archons can actually come up here as well now. And then Kerrigan, I want you to just come on down here. You can always stealth and take anything out you need to. You guys, come on in. We've got this base under control. No problem. Excellent. Completely taken care of. Archons OP. That DT is on his way down there. They are actually rebuilding down there. Um, I, I think... I mean, there's not actually any danger to Kerrigan here. We can just take this. Kerrigan? You were right next to it. I told you to go here, and you go here. Kerrigan, what are you doing? Are you drunk? Kerrigan, go here. Now go here. The crystal's here, boys. Send in a probe to gather it up, and our work here is done. You have done well, Kerrigan. There's more to you than it seems. Perhaps I have misjudged you. Given our history, I can't say I blame you. Let's just get the job done. Okay. I was afraid they were going to make me actually send a probe down there, but nope. That is not the case. Okay, so we got ourselves one of our crystals. Now we need to get the other one. The Battle of Braxis. Executor, our sensors have just identified a large group of Terran vessels. However, their configuration profile is unlike any Terran group yet encountered. We are receiving a transmission from the fleet's command ship. Identifying itself as the Alexander. Propos Commander, I am Admiral Alexei Stukov of the United Earth Directorate. We are here to take control of the Terran Dominion and all of its outlying colonies. You are in direct violation of Terran space and have openly attacked Terran troops. Lower your shields and power down your weapon systems. The UED will be taking custody of your ships and whatever spoils you have garnered from this planet. Yeah, that's not going to work. United Earth Directorate. Raynar spoke of the distant Terran homeworld called Earth. These humans have come a long way to make war on us. Have faith, Zeratul. You almost sound as if you fear these humans. What are they to such as we? Was it not we who defeated the dreaded Overmind? Yes, I tell us, we did vanquish the Overmind. But we did so with the help of humans. Do not be so quick to underestimate them. Of course. Executor, I shall test the metal of these humans by scouting ahead of your ships and finding a way through this blockade. In Toro Tassadar! Okay, so we need to destroy all power generators to pierce the UED blockade, and our Tannis must survive. So let's see what this entails, shall we? Okay, one of these missions. I gotcha. I am ready. So we have this force here. We have a few observers. So we can see that this is a safe place to land, and obviously that's what we want to do. I concur. Our Tannis is in this scout, interestingly. I I okay. Concur. Hop on the shuttle, everybody. Indeed. Let's come on up here. Be careful, Artanis. Consider it done. Oh, Artanis. No, 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 no. Artanis, just chill. Shuttles, I want you guys to land here. Okay. You too. There we go. <laughs> Sheesh. Okay, so we're going to use these ground forces to take care of these turrets. And we're not going to move in our scouts until the turrets are as taken care of as possible. But it looks like there are turrets roughly everywhere. Oh my, okay. So we've got a bunker here. And the question then becomes, how do we want to deal with the bunkers? Because they can attack our scouts as well. So we don't really have anybody who can super safely attack them, and we also have currently no way up here. I think we just run at them and kill them, hope that we kill them before our zealots run out of shields. Like so. Ah. 
They have a second bunker right there, though. That's a little awkward. Hmm. Yes, in that case, we need to bring our scouts in as well and make this happen. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Do you see that? I am ready. Get us vision here. Hold position. And no, get out of the way. There we go. <laughs> now we can take out these turrets. I did not realize that we could do that. For some reason, I was thinking these guys would work like the Reaver did and wouldn't be able to shoot up the cliff. But no, this is fine. If we can do that, then we can safely clear a lot of this, especially with the use of our observers. Okay. Yes, Executor. So with that being the case, we want to shy up to this side Indeed. and then attack. Get in here. Make it quick. Ah, kill him! Okay. Back off. No, back off. Don't go in. No. Okay, sit here. Just hold your position, guys. Okay. This is so awkward. Okay, we need to take out these turrets. There we go. Excellent. There are turrets everywhere. Okay, so at this point, I think we have our zealots attack the power generator. I wonder if taking out this power generator will deal with any of these turrets. I guess we'll find out. Has a lot of HP, there's no doubt about that. Okay. The missile turrets on this platform are no longer operational. However, we will need reinforcements to finish the job. Reinforcements are en route now, young Templar. Excellent. Okay, so we have additional shuttles for reasons unknown. But now we have additional ground forces, which is good. So these are all offline. But these are online. Okay. Yeah, I see. So how do we break in? Do we just walk that way? I think we walk that way. So let's go ahead and unload these guys here. And we've got these here. So now we know that we need to clear them on the ground and then we can move in our flying units. At least to some degree. So let's have our shuttles a bit off to the side over here. Additional Dragoons, DTs, come on, let's go. Uh, we don't need the, we don't need the Observer there. Um, okay, so we're going to need to shuttle our way over to here, actually. So let's utilize our shuttles and get over there. Scouts and Observers, you guys can go ahead and fly over there right now. All of you guys can hop in the shuttles. There we go. Excellent. And ground forces can then drop over here. And that should be functional. There we go. Is that all of our ground forces? I think it was. Nope, it was not. Okay. Air Force, you guys can go over here. And ground forces. Not including the shuttle. Come on over this way. And let's push in. Let's see what we've got. Looks like we have... We have a couple of turrets our dragoons can take on. So let's go ahead and do that while these guys push forward. Oh, actually we've got a... We've got a bunker here. We can... We can kill these turrets. Okay, those turrets are actually deactivated. We can kill these turrets, and without the detectors, we can theoretically kill that with our DTs, yeah? Assuming there are no other turrets up there. So let's take out these turrets. Oh, come on, guys. You guys can do it. Come on. Get up here. It's right here. <laughs> okay, don't. 
I'm going to send a single Dark Templar up just to scout. Okay, yep. Look at that. Perfect use for Dark Templars. Excellent. Yeah, go ahead and kill him. Get out of here, Terrans. We don't like you. Perfect. And then these guys can be kind of in reserve. Come on up here, DTs. Now we do have turrets up there. Okay. Back off, back off. Is there one position right here? No. Okay. Gotcha. So we kind of have to zerg that that one. We did a lot of damage to it, though. Oh, hello. That's a science ship. Okay. Well, let's go. Take them out, guys. Try not to lose any DTs. Okay. I think we're good. Fantastic. So now we have a million missile turrets here. There we go. Take out this one next. There we go. Is this a cliff here? I believe it is. We need to take out that science vessel if at all possible. It would appear that that is not possible. Okay, that's fine. Well, we'll take out these missile turrets. Oh, come on, guys. Guys, chill. Like, seriously, guys, just chill. Dragoons, get over here. <laughs> the rest of you guys, there isn't much for you guys to do. Oh, we have a Dragoon over here. I was wondering where we lost a Dragoon. Come on up here, Dragoons. And then we're going to need to bring our air units up. So come on up here, guys. Excellent. So can we finish off? Uh, we can't quite get to that. We can't quite get there. Uh, let's use our scouts to come on up here and do a couple of things. One, scout. And two, kill that science ship. Nice. Okay, so we see that there's a reasonably safe spot to drop right here. Excellent. Well, hop on into the into the shuttles, guys. Yeah, guys. Hop on into the shuttles. There you go. Excellent. Okay. There we go. Sheesh. Okay. Group up right over here. Uh, maybe not that far. But I want you guys to go ahead and drop right here. There we go. They're having some difficulties, but I think they got the drop. Yeah, there we go. Okay, back off, and we're going to be attacking this area. Let's take care of these missile turrets for right now. Of course, we do see that that right there... Ooh, hang on. Dragoons, I want you guys to take out this turret. And then I want this Dark Templar to... Actually, no. What am I talking about? We're going to need to come down here and take care of these millions of turrets. Take... Guys, no. No. Guys. Come this way. There you go. Stay out of range. Excellent. Okay. So we see that there are multiple bunkers over there. And we also see that there are two turrets over here. That's going to be a little bit exciting. I want you guys to let our dragoons out. We're going to need to... No. Where are you going? No. Guys. Dragoon, chill. What what are we doing here? <laughs> Come on, guys. Get up here. No. There you go. Okay. No. No. Okay. This is really awkward. Okay. This isn't going to be effective. Hmm. Okay. New plan. Yeah, um, now that I think about it, this is absolutely what we need to do. Focus fire here. Guys, shoot at it. Shoot at it. There you go. 
Run away. Run away. Okay. Now can we get this guy up here far enough away? No. This is still in range. Or is it this one? It might be that one up there. Zealots, I want you guys up here. To take out this. Oh my, we've got multiple bunkers. Okay, run away, run away. Okay, this is an interesting conundrum that we find ourselves in. Let's use not this Dark Templar, but this Dark Templar. See if we're out of range. Yeah, perfect. Okay, we can now eliminate this bunker. Excellent. Very nice. Yep, go ahead and kill that. There you go. Okay, so now the question is, can we get up to this one? And the answer is we can. Look at that. Excellent. Okay. Take him out. Nice. Okay, so we have another bunker over there. Guys, don't go up there. We don't want to go in range of that bunker because this turret is revealing us. No. No. Actually. Okay, that's fine. DTs, get up there. Excellent. Okay, this one will reveal us if we go that direction. We absolutely need, at this point, to take out these turrets. Oh, that tank is, is seeing us. Oh boy. Oh boy. Run! Run through! Okay. Are we still revealed? How are we still revealed? What is revealing us? No! No, all of our DTs. Oh, man. What was revealing us there? I didn't even see anything. We can't go that way. Hmm. Well, that's obnoxious. I don't even know what was revealing us there. Okay, Dragoons, I need you guys up here. Take this out. Now we have no DTs, though. Oh. That's really obnoxious. Do our Dragoons outrange their bunker? Can we kill their bunker from over here? We can, but I don't think we outrange it. No, I want you here. Nope, we don't outrange it. Okay, so with that in mind... Oh, they took a tank up here. Tank is dying to the Zealots. That's not a problem. Okay. So without DTs, this is going to get dicey. There is no doubt about that. We're going to have to utilize our scouts to some degree. Oh man, we can't go that way. Okay. Scouts, I need you guys to come up this direction and take out this turret. I know it's super dangerous. Get out of there. Ah. Take out that turret. Kill it. Kill it, guys. There you go. Sheesh. Okay, so how are we going to deal with this bunker without, their, without our DTs, though? I kind of feel like that screwed us really badly. Hmm. Do we just run at it with everything we've got? I feel like that's the only way forward at this point. Just run at it. Scouts, pull back. Okay, scouts back in. Okay. There we go. Scouts, you guys need to hold back and just chill. We've got more bunkers up ahead that we'll need to deal with. Yeah, there's just turrets everywhere along that trench that weren't revealed. Okay. 
Well, we should be able to... Oh, we've got ourselves a Wraith here. Kill that. Excellent. We've got ourselves a cannon and another bunker here. Kill that cannon. No, Zealot, get out of there. Why did the Zealot just run straight through that way? That was obnoxious. Oh, we're now out of Zealots as well. If only we had a Dark Templar. Like, I had no way of knowing that this was all here. Because I had to push with Dark Templars to get rid of the tanks so that we could get rid of the turrets so I could send in scouts to scout it. That's really insane. Okay. Uh, we can't send in the scouts because of this turret. I think we can safely ignore that bunker. That's the theory, anyway. Dragoons, come on up here. Scouts, what are you doing? Get out of there. I told you to stay here. There you go. Okay. So, we just need to get here. That's all we need to do. And then we'll get some reinforcements. Kill that wraith. Nice. Okay. We've got another wraith here. Here he comes. Kill the wraith. There we go. Okay, we can't cross this, and there are turrets everywhere, so we can't really... Oh, we have a Dragoon down here still? Get up here, Dragoon. Okay. Kill that Goliath. Nice. Okay, Dragoon, we need you up here with the rest of our ground forces. Okay, come on. We've got a Wraith. And it is time to put a cut in here. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. Oh boy. Do we win that? I think we do. Especially if I now kite this. There we go. Excellent. You guys head back to here. But I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in here. And next episode, we're going to see about finishing this off. See you all then.